Hello guys, uh, welcome to the Fuji FineFix HS25EXR review. Uh, you can call the camera uh, by HS28EXR, which is uh, very confusing on the internet. And I am making this review because of this camera have nothing and no, not even any resource on the internet and um, you know people are talking about this camera and it's not correct and you know um, it's really confusing to uh, have so many um, experiment on this camera uh, to viewing that kind of review or that kind of article so that's why i'm uh, making this kind of review so uh, you people get know this camera um, as it is and and you know so let's take a quick look on the body um, you can see only the uh, camera and the uh, whole body is black and it's come with one color which is black you're seeing right now um, you're seeing the back part of the camera this is for your tripod the whole and you're seeing the this this is for the battery and the battery is uh, it's like four triple a battery so you know so this is only the um, minus point of this camera because I love this camera very much but I hate it for the batteries you know uh, that's not even a problem you can take minimum 300 uh, photos with the full charge of the rechargeable batteries if you use Sony battery so that's pretty much not uh, the main problem so this is the 3 inch screen you can uh, you can uh, rotate it 160 degree as you want and it it will uh, uh, bang like this and this is your uh, viewfinder this is electric viewfinder and yeah that one is the electric viewfinder adjustment so you can adjust your eyes to, to the viewfinder this is uh, the buttons that on that come to your left hand so you can change the modes and all that we have iso autofocus and uh, web balance white balance or you can say anything on on all the settings are uh, on the left side of the camera and the menu is here we have a uh, dial which is default by you know uh, for the middle one is for function and uh, uh, up and down is for you know right left and right very easy display back is for using um, your uh, image information with the histogram so um, that's for the button and this is the record button the uh, autofocus lock button the led on of lock button and here comes the uh, dial that uh, have all mood on this camera this camera have um, lots of mood like exr exr is this camera's auto um, auto mood that um, generated by fuji films and you know this is very eye handy so anyone can take take pictures of it so this is the exr the program auto shutter um, aperture priority manual which is very favorite of my customs and they have the panorama also and this thing these three settings is made by fujifilm to take specific um, pictures of you know you can set like many uh, effects on the pictures so example if i select the sp1 um, it will it will allow you to uh, use your camera uh, set many different effects like reduce camera shakes on iso settings night scenery sports uh, natures cat dog um, portrait with the blur black background portrait with the soft skin tone and the family midnight photos uh, natural light with uh, the normal light and the text and the flowers party beach snow sunset even fireworks is uh, defaultly enhanced with these um, sensors so this is so far for the um, this three button and we you will have um, three um, those lots of effects for the uh, three settings 
three three parameter it's come the auto option and this is the exr and here is the uh, uh, flash um, barrel you can set any flash on this barrel and it's work fine for me and I use it it's perfectly doing good and here come the um, flash it's it's a high voltage flash and you know um, it's let me let me show you the flash priority or flash uh, silent mode okay I'll press and hold okay I don't know what's the wrong with this okay so flash is not not appearing I don't know how uh, okay we will take it later we'll show you the flash maybe it's not important and here comes the main lens which is 24 to 7 28 mm and this is the that little um, barrel is for manual focus which is very important I like it and this, this camera have 30x um, optical zoom and 60x intelligent digital zoom so your picture is uh, very sharp so this is the lens if you open it uh, this is so far the big one uh, this is very nice and you know uh, eye handy and it's, it's very it's very uh, compact you know and very easy and this is the flash um, okay let's head into the um, front part so this is the uh, lens I bought this um, lens cap uh, from the market because the camera is coming without the lens cap so and um, uh, under the main lens is totally open so I bought it from the market and it's very important you find this camera lens uh, this camera uh, lens cap on the market because it's the 24mm so that's pretty much not available in every market I have lots of experience bad experience with it so yeah coming to the upper portion here is your uh, shutter here is your shutter and this is two buttons for the uh, matching of the uh, shutter pra shutter parameter and the um, ISO or uh, you know the other settings and so say uh, let's see uh, let's take a picture with uh, close close look and use a macro super macro mode it will take uh, one centimeter one centimeter oh shit I'm sorry um, I take this manually so let's go to the EXR and see that the EXR how how EXR changed the mood and all that see the moods are already uh, changing by automatically and it's detecting the mood so we take the picture and here is the picture so this is the picture you can see it's pretty much good if you can see so perfect balancing perfect lighting perfect shutter perfect ISO and you can increase the ISO to um, 1200 and 8000 uh, uh, ISO mode they have on their auto and yeah so far this is the uh, and the display settings have the um, kind of uh, lots of um, tab that you are uh, selecting like HD or if you select the histogram you can select the histogram also so this camera is actually for those who are like um, new new photographer or uh, amateur photographer want to um, uh, like beginner level or something so this is the best for your uh, practice you know and um, I already told you that this have the uh, 30x digital zoom uh, 30x um, zoom and 30, 60x 
intelligent zoom and one centimeter super macro mode so you can take the super macro uh, as as um, as clear as you want and it's have also the image stabilization and the CMOS shift plus high ISO settings for your uh, pictures and this have built in by advanced anti blur so you can blur the background um, easily and uh, the picture look good okay and I already told you that this have the electrical viewfinder and um, for the quality of the photos and the movies you can take uh, 1080p movies on this camera and also you can uh, slow uh, you can shoot um, faster movie um, slow mo on this camera also this camera supported uh, maybe uh, 3 to uh, 320 fps um, on the video mode but there is lots of settings change on the view video mode which is uh, maybe I'm, I'm not tried at all to my my camera and um, yeah obviously the video will be HD um, and the main thing is the EXR processor EXR processor is good for is made by Fuji and it's good for um, you know the uh, taking pictures and all that and film simulation mode you will find some uh, five um, effect that is um, like standard vivid soft black and white and sepia uh, so this is for only for basic review so people don't get uh, uh, frustrated f after buying this camera as I did uh, there is no no review no um, no uh, you know no nothing on the internet I found I, I found lots of things happening and you know uh, they have every camera review but they don't have this camera review on their um, websites and even the Fuji is not telling uh, much more for this camera you know so uh, let's see uh, this is so for a basic review I am not giving any technical review or um, uh, you know a specification uh, so can uh, maybe uh, I can give you a little specification with this camera maybe if if possible later on I will do it uh, or um, you know so uh, oh the main part is the number of pixels is it's deliver 16.0 uh, million pixels and it's have the one or two inch EXR CMOS with the primary color filter which is the image sensor and storage you can use the SD, SDHC or SDXC uh, memory card and um, that and the camera is like have the 25 year internal memory on the on the default body so lens is uh, the focal length is um, 4.2 to uh, 120 uh, 126.0 mm uh, equivalent to 24 to 720 mm on a 30 mm camera and full aperture is to f2.8 um, wide to f5.6 telephoto and digital zoom already I told you two times that have um, 30x optical zoom and 60 digital zoom intelligent zoom actually aperture will be uh, f 2.8 to f 11 wide and f 5.6 to f 11 telephoto for the telephoto f 5.6 to f 11 for the telephoto okay and the focus distance is wide appro approximate like 55 to 55 to infinity or 1.4 uh, feet to infinity so um, then the um, so far this is the uh, basic review if you uh, if, if you um, expecting a uh, basic review so far I am done with it and flash will be auto flash and um, you can you you can add any flash on on this uh, figure okay so um, and the L LCD have a uh, 3 inch display 
on the camera and so far weight is like 730 gram maybe approximate I don't know um, and you know yeah so far so far this is for the camera I will put some uh, photos that I am taken for this cam with this camera and um, on the link below the link and um, I will put um, the link that you will find the exact um, description of the Fujifilm website and also I will I will post a group link on the description so you guys can join the group on the uh, Flickr actually I created it because I don't see any groups or any any links or any resource is uh, made for this camera okay so okay this is it um, if you like it um, give me a thumbs up uh, or comments or whatever you want um, ask something that you are confused with this camera I will try to um, get your answer as per as possible and yep and sorry for my bad English and yep thank you